This method can help answer key questions in social neuroscience, such as how the brain supports shifts in nationalistic or religious beliefs. The main advantage of this technique is that it allows us to actually go in and change the level of activity in a given brain region. This allows us to infer causal contributions of that given brain region in a particular behavior. Begin by seating the participant in the testing room and go over in depth with them how TMS works and all potential side effects. Have the participant fill out the TMS safety screen to ensure that they have no pre-existing factors that cause adverse effects. Make sure to remove all metal jewelry or accessories. Next, fit a grid-marked swim cap to the participant's head. Clean the skin over the tibialis anterior muscle thoroughly. Then attach two differential EMG recording electrodes to this area. Attach a third ground electrode to the skin over a bone somewhere else on the hand or arm. Next, on the swim cap, measure and mark the center location, CZ, on the participant's head. Have the participant sit comfortably and begin recording the EMG electrode output to software that will filter and display the signal. Next, to perform thresholding on the primary motor cortex, Place the center of a double cone coil over the motor cortex, held over to the scalp surface. Apply single pulse TMS at 50% of the maximum stimulus output, or MSO, and observe whether a motor-evoked potential, or MEP, was present.